Again, good afternoon, everybody. My name is Jeff Colbert, and this is Schoolies Mountain Chiropractic Center, your leader in alternative health care. In today's video, what I want to talk to you a little bit about is some of the technology that we have in the office. And this is a unit that is known as Zyto. And Zyto is basically a unit that allows us to have you get a scan done on 198 different biomarkers. Once we have you registered into the computer, it's literally simply resting your hand on this little hand electrode and then the computer is going to be sending electronic impulses into these biomarkers onto your palm. It is going to send a message into your body. Your body is going to interpret the message and send back a signal into the hand pad. And then the computer is going to interpret that and give us some phenomenal information that we can use to create a more individualistic healthcare program for you. And so what Zyto does, it gives us a report. And there's a number of factors that get done onto this report. And the first and most important thing that we look at is we will take a look at what are or what is Zyto telling us that you need nutritionally. Now for this particular patient, one of the things that this gentleman needed was ashwagandha forte. And it's through a company known as MediHerb and Standard Process. This is a whole foods vitamin and nutrition company that we have selected, mostly because of the quality of the uh, ingredients and the nutrients that they provide for our patients and that they support chiropractic 110%. So I love to, to give back to a company that's supporting our profession. So ashwagandha for this gentleman is going to start to bring in um, the biomarkers that it told us he had out of 198, he had 48 that were out of sync. So if we give him ashwagandha, which is a calming herb, it is there and designed to be kind of like you sipping a chamomile tea. Okay, so ashwagandha was going to bring 35 of his 48 uh, back into uh, sync and in rhythm. It also gives us some other nutritional information that he can use that will bring the other 13 uh, into into sync and then it gives us a nice description of those nutritional supplements and a little bit of a background if there should be anything that would be there that would be a contraindication especially to taking any of the herbs with any of the medications that you might be taking so it's a great backup for us it also gives us information in terms of what is going on with a patient's organs and glands and if you'll notice there's a center line here and we would really like to see as much as possible the energy bars kind of all hovering around that center line. The thing that we really start to pay attention to is when organs and glands are starting to show zero energy. That is like having no energy, no electrical input going into those systems. And we also pay attention when things are far, far, far too energetic into the system. So this allows us with the use of applied kinesiology to be able to double check what's going on with a patient in the room when we are sitting there doing the muscle testing uh, before each and every adjustment. The next component that this will give us is what is going on with the spine. Okay, again, we're looking at for where there is more tension or more energy and less energy. So it, again, it helps us to identify which sections of the spine need to be most and primarily adjusted to start to restore this patient's spine and overall health back to normal. Then we get into what's going on with the meridian system. Okay, and again, this we tie in with our acupressure charts, the touch for health charts, and it also allows us to be able to intelligent re refer a patient to an acupuncturist and give that acupuncturist a little bit of information in terms of what is going on with that patient. The thing that I like most with this system is it'll tell us what are your biological preferences for care. So we use a number of different techniques and a number of different therapies and exercise programs within the office. This will just give us a little bit more information to customize the ideal program of care for you. So for this particular gentleman, his number one preference for care would be foot orthotics. And so we utilize a company known as uh, Foot Levelers. We can custom mold orthotics and have those individually made for you so that it custom fits your foot and your particular foot's needs and biomechanical faults that are there with your spine. So he was, his number one was foot orthotics, followed by therapeutic massage, followed by exercise, you also needed to pay attention to a 10-day blood sugar cleanse. Lowest on the biological preference totem pole 
was that of cold laser therapy. And this gentleman is a mixed martial artist um, and he does a lot of kickboxing, that type of stuff. And so when he comes in, he's generally fairly beaten up. So cold laser is an easy, easy, easy pick for him. And then we get into what goes on with your body's core. Okay, so again, this breaks it down into detoxification, gastrointestinal, hormone and endocrine system, uh, immune system, diet and uh, nutrition, hydration, inflammation, emotional stressors, sleep, and toxic stress. So again, this gives us the ability to see what's going on. So in terms of his toxic stress system, the number one thing that is mostly out of whack is diet and nutrition. And for this gentleman, you're gonna see as we go through some of this, there's gonna be some repeated patterns. So on the gastrointestinal system, esophagus shows up. When we look into the hormonal endocrine, it's diet and nutrition something that we've already seen. The immune system, lymph nodes need to be brought back into system, okay? And again, that can be improved greatly with hydration. This was something that was interesting on his diet and nutrition. It showed that his diet and nutrition is a little bit higher in herbicides than we might like, and that might be creating some toxic reactions with his body in terms of why the lymph nodes might be swollen and inflamed. Again, in hydration, depending on where he's getting his water supply, again, it showed up that there were more herbicides that were going on and into his system than we would probably like. And then again, in terms of inflammation, viruses were showing up as well as the inflammatory system. We get into the mental and emotional components of somebody's health. Remember, health is a balance between what goes on physically, what goes on emotionally, and what goes on biochemically. So far, we've dealt a lot with the things that can be going on biochemically. This gets us into what's going on emotionally. So the system that's most involved is the central nervous system, and as a chiropractor, I'm most concerned with what the nervous system is telling us because ultimately it is the nervous system that controls and coordinates all of the functions, organs and glands, healing and repair that goes on in the body. But interesting, the thing that showed up with him emotionally was that uh, emotion of jealousy, okay? And when we questioned him on that, you know, he does very well in the ring and in the octagon, but there's that little part when he is not living and meeting his own expectations, he's, get, he's getting extremely jealous of those people who are outperforming him. Why them, not me? And so again, that's one of the things that on the emotional side, if you're constantly thinking a negative emotion, that is going to have a huge impact on your health. His sleep was being impacted by diet and nutrition. So again, we've seen that diet and nutrition pattern come up a number of times. And then toxic stressors were that of electromagnetic fields uh, coming in and affecting his health. The latest thing that uh, Zyto has been able to do for us, it allows us to now take a look at different food categories that are more positive for you or more negative for you. So for this gentleman on a positive food category, uh, it came up nuts and seeds, dairy and eggs. The things that were more on the negative side were uh, fats and oils, grains, meat and poultry. And then we broke it down to beans and legumes. So soybean was high, string beans was considered less high for him. So just again, if there's something going on in your diet, we can start to shift and modify it. So again, you can see that Zyto gives us a tremendous amount of information in terms of what nutritional supplements you need to take, how your organs and glands are getting affected, what emotions might be there, what areas of the spine and the acupuncture system need to be addressed. And the thing that I love the most about it is that the fact that we can get what your top five biological preferences are for care and literally custom make a uh, health and wellness program that encompasses a number of factors. What are the exercises that you should be doing? What nutrition should you be favoring? What should you be doing to try to improve your sleep? Work on your posture, your mental attitude in terms of those emotional components that can be there. And most importantly, help us to augment what we do in the rooms with you, chiropractic adjusting wise. So I hope you found this information today extremely helpful. If you would love to try to come in to uh, get a Zyto experience along with an initial exam to see how our office may be able to support you in terms of relieving your symptoms, getting the problem corrected, and then overall promoting long-term health and wellness within your body, please feel free to check out our website, smcc4u.com. Go to the patient information tab, download our forms, give our office a call, speak to our front desk or our insurance office. They will go over your 
uh, insurance. They will qualify your insurance, see what your insurance covers, does not cover. We'll have you come in for a history and consultation. We'll schedule a time out for an exam that will include a chiropractic exam, a scan in the back that goes over thermal graph surface EMG, x-rays when they're appropriately needed, and then we can set you up for a Zyto scan so that again we can see what is going on in your system to make it totally unique and how we can create a program of care especially designed for you. So I hope you've liked this information. If you could hit like and subscribe and visit our website, that would be great. In the meantime, you guys have a great day and we will see you in a future video.